After this scene of gun violence unfolded Monday outside a Roseville school, authorities say they now know the person who pulled the trigger is not 14. He's actually 13. We've had numerous dealings with him, so we'll be seeking uh, the most serious charges we can. The Macomb County prosecutor announcing Tuesday that the teen had a court hearing and is facing multiple charges, including assault with intent to murder and carrying a concealed weapon. We've had numerous contacts in the last two weeks with this young man. It's tied up considerable amount of resources. The question many are asking is what's driving the violence? The teen's mom calling Fox 2 to say her son is being lied on and then directing us to contact her lawyer who has not responded to the call. But those who know the shooting victim. He was going to pick up all three of his kids and uh, the oldest one was approached by the shooter brandishing a gun, threatening to shoot him, shoot up the car and everyone there. That's when the victim stepped in. So he tried to disarm him and, you know, trying to disarm him, he got away and turned around and shot him in the chest and shot him in the elbow. He took the bullets to save the lives of other kids. Roseville Community Schools releasing a statement Tuesday stating the suspect is not a current student in their district, but officials would not say if that's because the student had been expelled. The teen's next court date is March 29th. Police say this teen needs help, and if he is going to be rehabilitated, the courts and police need to intervene. There's always a chance for rehabilitation, but we do our job to uh, get him off the street and get him the resources he needs to rehabilitate. And Roseville, Ingrid Kelly, Fox 2 News.